Hello everyone, this is G-Shock High Fashion Channel. Today I'm going to make a video on this little girl. Alright, this will be just a module demonstration for this baby G model. If this is not your type of video, you can just skip this one and watch tomorrow's video. It will be about G-Shock. Most of my videos will be mostly on G-Shock. But I'm still going to make a video on this because this model is pretty special. It in a rest of quality. Oh. You guys need to watch the unboxing and review video as well to understand more on this model. For now, I'm just going to show you guys the back plate. Look at that. This baby G operates on 1523 module BG320. Just in case you have one of this in your possession or just in case someone have it, at least now you know or have a guide on what to expect on this model. Especially if you're finding this in used condition, perhaps since this baby G gonna be pretty cheap I'm guessing you guys might consider grabbing one of these if you know the functions first let's have a look at the test screen one two three buttons at the same time here is the test screen for this baby G model zoom in a little bit for you guys to be able to see it better and there it is so Cassie up there gonna have alarm light on or switch over here this will be start stop or alarm on or off Mode select over here, split yourself over here for the adjust button. They already written down the purpose of each four buttons over here. So the test screen, from the test screen alone you can tell we have digits over here. In the middle will be for lettering. And down here will be for digits to tell the time, split, signal and alarm. So this split button is actually this. Three buttons will be on resume, pretty big. So it's gonna make it easy to operate. And this adjust button is simple steel button. So you're not gonna accidentally press this button, you know, so very utilitarian type of baby G actually. So down on this a test screen, press this one, so we'll back to home time. At the home time, we're gonna have this date up here. I haven't set up this watch yet, so it's preset to a factory setting. So this will be the time at PM. If you press the light button at home time, it will light on in yellow colorway and an animation is going on, a guy dancing. I have no idea what type of dancing that that he's doing which looks really good. Look at that, look at that. It's very funny. Let me try it again. What is that? Yeah, most likely like a b-boy type thing. So for break dancing, which this watch is made for actually. So this will have this nylon straps, those are all the sweats and comfort fit and strong, no worry and all that colorful vibes. Okay, anyway, that's for the light at home time. So if you press this lower right button over here, you could access the 12 hour or 24 hour system, press it once, look at that. So the 11 will switch to 23 hour, 2303. And at the same time, this middle part over here, RI, you will wait a little bit, it will display FRI, which is Friday, the date that is for that uh, date. Press, if you change to 24 hour system, it will switch to lettering instead. All right, G H O C K. H F so G Shock High Fashion and dots over here. I already set it up. You can uh, set this up yourself. You can write anything that you want actually. So pretty interesting thing. So if you turn on this 24 system and display this G button at this mode, if you press just look at that, you are able to set this lettering over there. So let's have a look what what we could set up. So that will be the G H I J. I'm gonna run through all the letters and numbers if any. So it's gonna be only letters let's go back to G I'm gonna set it up to G over there and press mode we're gonna have H O C K uh, six letters H seven letters eight letters altogether so it's already written the numbers down there as well so this will be at the eighth letter and at the same time you're still able to tell the time while you are setting this thing All right done press just finish setting up this lettering Press this 24 hour system to switch it back to day date display instead and time. And here, if you press adjust, you can set up the time normally. You don't have to hold the adjust button, you just need to press this one and it will start picking the setting. So that's why this button is a recess. You don't want to accidentally press this. As always, you need to set up the seconds first, reset to zero if you want to. Press mode to set up the time. You know what? Let's set the time. It's it is actually 3 a.m. in the morning while I was filming this. So 3.19, you only have access to this little red button. 
the upper right button will still operate the light so this one button only to set up this thing 11 all the way to 19 8 15 16 17 18 19 here it is present mode again we'll set the calendar so to set it up it will max up to 239 wait uh missed it see you know what let's run through all the the years so 7 3 8 3 9 repeat to 1995 so press it all the way to 2017 5 6 7 for the months it's gonna be it should be in july actually 7 oh missed it again press and hold it to quick scroll 7 so the date will be i'm wearing one actually or not the g-shop version of this so i'm gonna use this as a reference gonna be 24th july so 24th july 2017 let's scroll quick 20 one two three four down on the calendar setting press mode don't set up the watch very simple don't have any hidden functions and all that you know I mean the all the hidden function that it has of course that dancing animations and all the 24 or 24 system for that light ring with it. Since we already changed the date, you can see now it will display Monday. M O N. So that's how you know it's Monday. So you kinda need to wait a little bit to to be able to tell the day of the week what day it is. So anyway, it's still an interesting thing to have. Press mode, we will go to the first one which is A L. A L look at this animation with that A L so it's gonna be alarm. Very simple. You can set up the date. Now up here will still shows the current time. Down here will be the time that you want to the alarm to ring. Press the adjust button and of course you know what? Press it. I need to set this thing up first. Look at that. 8 p.m. or 9 7. I need to. Let's try to set it up. I want to set it up to just 10 a.m. in the morning for for no reason at all. 10 20 a.m. in the morning and press adjust to finish setting up this alarm to turn it on press this lower right button down here look at that you can on, turn on the signal turn on the alarm both of them or switch both off press mode we will go to the next one which is TR up here will still shows the time 321 a.m. TR TR stands for timer press adjust you can set this timer all the way max to 60 minutes timer which is pretty much uh, utilitarian and if you want to set it up to your routine dancing session, you can do it as well. Set it up to uh, 30 minutes or one hour training session and just start your training and just take a rest after it's time for your run. So it's pretty much so simple. Let's run this uh, one minute countdown timer and see what will happen when the time runs off. Look at that, we have a weird type of animations going on over there as the time is going down. Press the like buttons. That's Figure where they will start dancing again. So I'm just gonna wait and let's see what will happen or how it's gonna ring when it reach zero. There it is. When the time runs off, the figure thing stick man will start dancing again with that beat for about 10 seconds only and done. That's done on the timer, press mode, we will go to the next one, SD, SD, we'll keep repeating, so it's gonna be a stopwatch. Seems like we cannot adjust anything on here, look at that, nothing gonna happen, so 1 over 100 seconds stopwatch, pretty interesting, and look at that, different type of animation will start moving, and let's split time as well to see what's gonna happen. So it's gonna be like that type, that type of animation, split will turn on over there, split off, continue the time, and we'll keep rotating like that stop continue or stop so look at that the animation will stop over there as you stop the stopwatch stop and reset back to sd simple i think it's gonna max out to 60 minutes as well i'm not sure press mode we will go to the last one which is back to home time done every functions on this model very easy and simple baby g model don't have a lot of functions and that is all again very interesting model. I hope you guys found this video useful, informative, and entertaining as well for your future reference. So leave a like if it does, and also subscribe to see more contents like this in the future. Thank you very very much for watching us. This is G-Shock channel, and um. Oh.